Developing tonight, Hamburg police are investigating rape allegations against NHL star Patrick Kane. News 4's Ali Ingersoll is taking a look at the legal process investigators and lawyers are working through right now. Ali? Callan, police say a woman filed a complaint against Patrick Kane last week, and at this time, Kane has not been charged with anything. Our legal analyst says investigators must be thorough for these types of cases, and that's what's taking so much time right now. Investigation itself was leaked. Um, we don't know who did it, but and it gets leaked because of his celebrity, because Patrick Kane is who he is. So information that probably would be secret and confidential for anyone else, it's leaked because he's a celebrity. And that's one of the disadvantages. And some of that information gets out, it gets to the media, it gets to other individuals, and then we hear this evidence at a premature stage. We don't hear it after a charge has been filed. News 4's legal analyst Terry Connor says the police process of gathering evidence and testimony is rigorous, especially when it comes to high-profile cases like Pat Kane's. The real test will be is there enough evidence to prove beyond a reasonable doubt that a crime was committed. That decision is ultimately made by the jury, but prosecutors need to evaluate the evidence with that ultimate decision in mind. Connor says the hockey star and South Buffalo native Kane is getting the same treatment anyone else with these allegations against them would receive. He should be treated just as fairly as any individual who's the subject of an investigation. And that's something that protects all of us because if someone like Patrick Kane can't get due process of law, how can someone, anyone who has a lesser standing in the community obtain it? It would be something that would be fundamentally abhorrent to our system if that were to occur. He deserves due process of law, and so does the individual who makes the complaint. You need to follow the rules. It's as simple as that. Kane has hired Paul Cambria as his lawyer. The 26-year-old Chicago Blackhawk has been represented by Cambria before. When you have a previous relationship, you know so much more about the individual. You have the ability to, uh, to relate better, perhaps. You have the ability to uh, keep in mind what's the perspective that is taken from this particular case based upon prior events. Connor says there's scrutiny from everyone right now as this investigation was jumped to the national spotlight. He says it's critical for investigators to have time to work through all of the evidence. Live in the studio tonight, Ali Ingersoll, News 4 at 6.